Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If it's your first time watching some of my videos, I hope you enjoy them and I hope you subscribe as well. Um, what I'm doing here is I'm making some envelopes to use for my stamp, my passbook stamp um, swapping. Um, it's always nice to receive um, a decorated envelope. I don't cover the whole envelope. Um, I like to make sure that the address can be um, read easily, especially as they're going overseas, and I really don't want them to go missing. So as you can see, I was just using um, a roller or a brayer with some yellow paint, and I just roughly rolled onto the side of the envelope. Now I'm using another, um, it's a pink glittery paint, and I use the Punchinella just to make some a bit of a pattern. Um, once this paint dries though, it actually is almost clear. Now I'm just using a stamp, just to put a bit of a, an image on there. I don't always use the same stamps, I don't always use the same colors. Sometimes instead of using the paint, I will use um, just a, a ripped piece of uh, a jelly print, just for something different. Um, I don't always use a stamp, it depends. I just make a batch of them um, and then use them up and make another batch. Now what I'm doing is just adding a little bit of washi tape and I'm just putting some glue underneath just to make sure it um, survives the journey. And I won't use the same washi tape on all of them, I'll just use different ones. Two, do a little bit of layering depending on the size or the design of the washi tape. It doesn't take me very long to make them. Um, I probably will make maybe eight or ten in a batch. Um, doesn't last me very long because I do do quite a lot of swaps. They're just plain envelopes from, um, I think these ones were from just a cheap shop actually. Now what I'm doing is I'm just sticking the passbook little emblem that someone designed on the front of the envelope. And you'll notice I have actually stamped a sentiment on these ones as well. I think it says sending you a smile. And I have my address that I'll stick on the back and I also stick a little um, circle it's a like a stamp that says happy mail and that's basically all I do it doesn't take long as I said and I'll just make a, a batch of them um, have them ready and what I will do is I will make sure that I have all the other bits and pieces I usually include a little packet of some dies or stamped images or something like that to go with the stamps and I'll just pop them all in when I know what stamps I'm sending people name and address on the front um, write airmail and usually I'll take a photograph of it and then post it off and that's how I send my stamps and that's the end of the video so thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.